Berlin's an area where there's a lot of deprivation, unemployment, drugs, alcohol. I've been brought up here and uh, in the 80s, it, there was a community. There used to be a lot of factory work. All this work's gone, so people have moved on. The area where I'm working, there's a lot of divide and there's not a lot of interaction. There's nowhere to go, you know, how can people meet? Because it costs money and people just haven't got the money. I'm a near neighbours worker. The job entails going out in the community and trying to get people together, different groups, in an activity they enjoy doing. I met this lady called Janet Swan and she was interested in setting up a choir and I thought it was a good idea. We had the induction day at Caldwell House to introduce the ladies and obviously to see how many were interested. Hi, I'm Janet. Hi, Janet. Do you want to get yourself a drink? We're just going to have fun and explore several different songs and really enjoy ourselves. That's, that's what I want to happen today. Hiya! 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 Hiya, Marina! Hiya! Singing is something that humans have always done. So that kind of connection of doing something that is a new skill, that is sh so shared, that you don't have to do on your own, you're doing it with other people and it's starting to sound really nice, is I think what is so magical about singing. Come and sing, come and sing, come and sing, come and sing. It's hard to believe, looking at that, that we've all you know, been together uh, for a time. And I think they're probably just as surprised as I am that we can actually sing. But it was really good. I'm hoping it continues. You always get a them and us, wherever you live. But it's nice that we've all come together. Before you know it, you've made friends with, with everybody. I didn't expect it to you know, turn out like this, because I can't sing, and I think everybody else thought that they couldn't sing. But it just sort of like all gelled together. You could really feel that sense of people wanting to sing together and be together. Come and sing, I said, come and sing, come and sing for joy. Whoa. Near Neighbours funded it all from start to finish, the sessions and everything, the refreshments, everything. So it was free for everybody, so that's really good. Even if they had that dream of learning to sing, they couldn't have done it because being a deprived area, they can't afford to sort of treat themselves because it's a treat for them to actually go to the choir. I hope everybody's uh, well and uh, ready to sing. The choir is going to start sustaining itself and it's bringing the community together. All right, it's a small step, but you need them small steps to get to the bigger things. No matter how people dress or whatever, at the end of the day, they're still human and they still have the same feelings and they still have the same aspirations in life as well for the family and themselves. Everybody's so friendly, so welcoming. So it doesn't matter if I've if I don't know anybody, you can just sit with anybody and start a conversation. And it's also about sharing the culture and like what we've been singing today, Shalom, which is peace, but in Arabic it's Salam, so it's very similar. So it's, I think it just helps with that connectivity and, and that bonding between us. Just seeing people develop and get and gaining confidence, that's really good. And then just make a really beautiful sound and that, that moment when they just really love it and hear the harmonies together, that's, that's the best thing. We're all from different backgrounds in terms of not just age, but also uh, in career uh, and, and religion and faith. We get to know about each other as well, and then we feel more at ease. So I enjoy that very much. After three. We're just people. We're not Asian, we're not Muslim, we're not British, white, we're, or anything. We're just ladies who get together and sing.